Hey everyone, welcome out to Disney's Old Key West Resort. We're here at one of the most amazing resorts here on property. One of the oldest too for Disney Vacation Club and we're just getting checked in so we thought it'd be a really nice thing to come on up, show you our room. We've got a one bedroom here that we're really excited about because we've never actually stayed in it. So come on, let's go check this out. Our room is actually 4911, so I think we gotta go up. Yeah, up it is. Correction, we are not going up, so yeah. <laughs> All right, building 49, number 11, here we go. All right, here we go. We're coming on in here to the one bedroom. You can see it's got a nice spacious hallway. These are meant to be like a home away from home. I'm really digging this superb living room here. Look, they've just renovated all of the rooms here. So it's got a nice coral theme right here in the artwork. We don't even have all of the lights on, but it's still very well lit. Nice hardwood floors. We also got the inset TV right here. Beautiful, beautiful dining area. And because we're on the first floor, we actually have a walkout porch, not necessarily a balcony, but it's rather spacious as well. Kitchen is right here too. So you can see you've got all kinds of home amenities, even extra space here for like buffet or setting things out. Uh, lots of different cabinetry. You also have a full size range oven, microwave, uh, refrigerator, and full size dishwasher here, which is really nice. Right here at the very front, you have your coat closet. So you've got some extra space and it also includes a Bissell steamer, maybe, I think it is, and your vacuum just in case you have a little bit longer stay and a few coat hangers. Coming into here past the hallway is your main bedroom. So you can see it's got a nice little buffet style right here, cushion to sit on. Got almost a full length mirror, another TV, and there's a secondary entrance out to the balcony, but check out how cute this little cabinet is underneath the TV and you've also got several different USB outlets and uh, standard US outlets as well. You've also got the massive king size bed. Look at how amazing that is. Get a look at how awesome this bed is. It's a big old like California king size and I do love that it has that old Key West vibe here because you've got this massive jacuzzi tub that you can overlook through here. And then right here we've got another storage area with your safe, a couple of hangers, extra pillows and blankets as well when those turn out because the sofa is a bed as well as the um, recliner over this way too because it turns out into a single bed as well. Now coming out of the hallway here from the very front door, if you turn down to your immediate left in this floor plan, this is a one bedroom unit so it does come with a full size washer and dryer here so you can do your own laundry. It's really convenient for some of those longer stays, especially larger families like us. And then you also have a full size iron and ironing board as well. But it does also have a separate door out into the bathroom. You see all the recently renovated bathroom touches here including that beveled edged mirror they've got the updated countertops here along with a few cubby spaces you've got the extended open shower right here but i really love the touches that they've done with the glass there but it has a separate area from this jacuzzi tub which is kind of nice because then you have two separate areas to shower or bathe or get ready and all that good kind of stuff so yeah Okay, so there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this tour of the one bedrooms here at Disney's Old Key West Resort. It's a family favorite just because there's so much space here. Um, and while there's not a whole, whole lot on the amenities list that my kids really enjoy, uh, everything is really kind of mainly focused around the hospitality house, which is its main check-in. So all your food, your main pool, uh, the fitness centers, the community hall, all of that is right there at hospitality house. But if you're in some of these back buildings and there are a couple of pools back this way which are 24 open 24 hours so that was kind of a nice thing for us to learn too so if you can't make it out to the main pool which closes about 10 
which closes about 10 p.m., then you at least have the option of the other quiet pools too. They just won't happen to have a slide. So um, thanks for looking at our room and we'll catch you on the next ride. Bye everybody.